Mega Man. Welcome to What's the Deal with Sam? Starring Sam Good. Join Sam as he discusses a wide variety of topics. Now let's start the show. Thank you. Alright guys, so this is me talking about a thing that's not this drink, which I did do a video on. But instead, I want to know, what's the deal with Mega Man Legacy Collection 2? It's like Mega Man Legacy Collection with the ground. I'll just be sipping on this while we speak of it because I want to finish it. Whew. Oh, I'm going to be fucked up, but full of energy. Um, so the Mega Man Legacy Collection 2, in case you guys didn't know, it's got... Mega Man 7, 8, 9, and 10 on it. Um, kind of a follow-up to the first Legacy Collection, which was 1 through 6. Um, but this one, I believe, was only being released on... It's on PC, it's on Xbox One, and PS4. I don't know that it's anywhere else. Um, and... I guess I, 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 found, I found it really weird. I had a lot of weird gripes about this kind of thing, like... You know, why aren't there more games on it? Or why is it still called the Legacy Collection? Shouldn't this be like the Mega Man Leftover Collection? Or the Mega Man... You know... Those other ones collection? It's uh, it's more classic Mega Man, sure. More of the original Mega Man. But it's not like... You know, we won't talk fondly of 7, 8, 9, and 10. Um, and so, like... It seems weird to still call it part of the Legacy Collection. Also, I kind of... Because I kind of thought that Legacy meant, like, well, we're going to call it that, so it's just the NES games. That's the legacy of Mega Man. Um, and they're not doing that. Instead, they're like, uh, well, well, we really, we just said that as... We just did just the NES ones because then we could put it on the 3DS also and sell a bunch of games on that because a lot of people had a 3DS. And now we've got these other ones. Um... They're just like the leftovers, and they're like, I guess whoever at Capcom decided to collect these didn't do a very good job collecting in the first place if we couldn't collect these ones along with it that have also been out since then. It's not like these are new. We're like, oh, hey, we forgot that 7, 8, 9, and 10 and were a thing for years. I don't know. And, uh, fuck, I don't know, man. Just weird. It's really weird. Um, God, it's like, it's like liquid candy. Um, and, and I also, I guess, it sucks that it's not on 3DS, probably can't run there, not on a handheld. Um, uh, what I think is a little weird is that it doesn't, it's also weird that it's not on the Switch, as far as I know yet, either, or I don't know if it's even gonna go there or not, I don't know. So that's an interesting thing. Um, I figure, like, it... It, 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 I'm just a little bummed, I guess, myself, because I feel like it should run on my computer. My computer is from 2012, which I believe is newer than any of these games, but because of some of the way they programmed it or whatever the fuck, it's not really optimized for that. It, it just doesn't run. Instead of instead of running poorly on my computer, like most things that don't usually you know work on it, or just having an error message come up, it tried to open it, and then it just wouldn't. And this was after I found out about it, like, it was my birthday came up, and I was like, oh, shit! I got this, this gift card for Steam, and it's like, I, that's like when I was looking for stuff, I was like, oh, Mega Man Legacy Collection 2 drops in like a week. Man, I'm gonna get that shit, and I waited, and I got it at launch, and it didn't work. He just brought up a black screen like it was trying to open it maybe for a second, and it stopped. And after dicking around the forum, I was trying to get an answer to this shit, basically, the, the response that came back was, ah, yeah, it's, uh, it doesn't run on your computer, it doesn't run on your computer. We're, it's, we're not gonna try to make it work. Uh, I guess I just can't. And, you know, that's, like, an optimization problem, I guess. But also, like, my computer's not really all that new. It's not that great. I'm used to it. I, at least I know now. At least I'm like, okay, they're not. it's not a thing they're going to patch. It just doesn't work. No one's mad. Um, <laughs> so that was a pretty big bummer. Uh, but, hey, like, 
I don't know, like, I was thinking about it, and honestly, the reason this collection seems okay, I mean, like, yeah, people bitch about the price. It's 20 bucks for four games, not even four beloved games, four, like, whatever, maybe you give a shit about one or two of them, typically. But talking about the average person here. And, well, it's basically just, just, just in the sense of numbers, like, yeah, 20 bucks for four games when the first collection was 15 bucks for six. Like, you do the math, right? But, uh, maybe you're trying to make this use, like, well, these games are newer, the Mega Man 7 and Mega Man 8 are bigger, they're a different style, and, like, whatever. I can... The file for this thing, I've heard, is also, like, ridiculously large for what the stuff is, but uh, I don't know. Um, I don't know the technical shit behind anything. But I thought about it, and the more I thought about it, I was like, this sounds about right, you know, 20 bucks, because it's like, it's not that bad for four games, Try to get them elsewhere might cost you more. These games are spread across multiple systems and weren't super available. You probably didn't own all of them at the same time. And um, so having them all in one place for like one collection of them, especially for, um, you know, like on PC, where I don't believe they were available before, um, you know, legally anyways, you're like, yeah, like that's actually, that's not too bad of a deal. And it's geared towards Mega Man fans who they've already, you know, they already played the classics. They've played 1 through 6. They get it. They've done that collection. They, they've they played it. Sweet. Um, they're looking for more Mega Man. They're willing to probably pay a few extra bucks to get some Mega Man games they haven't heard about, you know, haven't heard people talk to death. And I think it's, I think it's decent. I think it's, it's okay. Oh. I think this maybe should have been the Mega Man Legacy Collection 3. Hear me out. Mega Man Le Legacy Collection 2 should have been the Game Boy games. There's like five of those. Or maybe those could have been added on to this, I don't know. But it should have been the five Game Boy games. And uh, I think there was like maybe a... The, I don't know if there was a Game Gear one or a Genesis one or something. I don't know, but put those all into a pack. And then do the remixes and challenges and art and all that other bullshit that they put in, all, in these, right? Make that the Mega Man Legacy Collection 2 as companion piece. And that way they could have released it on these same systems, plus they could have put it on the Vita, if that thing is still being supported. I think it is. I don't know. Do you go? I don't fucking... And you can put it on the 3DS, because they just had the new 2DS XL or whatever the fuck come out. And it's like, you know, that long ago, and you're like, well, yeah, I guess they could still, like, work on that before the that's dead. That would still probably get a lot of sales for people who have the 3DS and everything, and all those people that still have it. Um, it could go on everything, and it would have been, a, a, you know, interesting for that. And that could have been 15, 20 bucks, depending on what's on there. And while we're at it, what, I mean, then you would do this as the third, because by then, people, the 3DS will be gone, you won't need to worry about it. And maybe make it work for the Switch, I don't know. Um, plus, people are still kind of complaining, like, what about Mega Man and Base? What about um, the Wily Wars? Uh, the Mega Man arcade games? Um, I don't think there's too many people complaining about Mega Man Soccer. But, you know, there's... There's other games they could have thrown on this collection, or they could put on another collection or something to do, and, they, and they're just not there. I don't know. There's there's complaints to be had all around, but honestly, it's not too bad of a collection for what it is, I guess. Just wonder why they called it the Legacy Collection 2, why they didn't call it something else, or why they didn't put it in part of the first collection, or I kind of understand why, but then, I don't know. I don't know. And hey, I mean, like, you know, what's, what's the deal with the Mega Man Legacy Collection 2? Uh, it's like, the Mega Man Anniversary Collection with the Grand. And now people won't shut the fuck up about getting a Mega Man X Collection, so... Boy, aren't you, isn't that a great way to launch? To have your game launch, like, here's this, this Mega Man Legacy Collection 2 is finally out. Let's see what people are saying in the, in the forums. And half the posts are people saying, Where's the Mega Man X Collection? Do it next! I like Mega Man X better! Anyways, man, really great incentive, guys, that this is a game you're not even playing and you want another collection of games so then you can request. The next thing, you ever enjoy something in your fucking lives? You ever sit down and, like, play a game or you just wait for it to come out, look at it and say, Ooh, where's the next one?
God damn. Can you ever sit back on a, on a, on a, on a day and sip your Mega Man E-Tank? And just enjoy your fucking game for once in your miserable lives? As I can, and my life is, is at least as miserable as some of yours. So, this is not alcoholic, I just, I sound slurred sometimes. Cause that's what my face does. I'm bad at speaking. Especially in public. I already did the with the ground thing, right? We should have ended this probably at that part. But I'm not gonna do a bonus bit, so this is all just gonna be a really long thing. I'm almost done with my can, so. I'm drawing it out on purpose. <sighs> Sweet. All right, I'm gonna go kick Dr. Wiley's ass. Oh God. Here is a bonus clip, cause I, I forgot I was gonna mention this when I talked about the other thing, the Mega Man Maker thing. I haven't checked it out yet. I might. We'll see what happens. But the Mega Man Maker, or maybe it's just called Mega Maker. I don't fucking. I, don't, I haven't looked into it very deep, as you could tell. But what it is is a fan-made thing. I guess Capcom's okay with it, cause I believe it's still up. Uh. Because they're not Nintendo. <laughs> uh, and they're like, well, okay, well, basically what it is is a way to make levels in Mega Man, like NES Mega Man levels. And they're like, it's essentially Mario Maker for Mega Man. And I just got to say that I'm really interested in checking that out. Sounds awesome. That idea, that kicks ass. Why not take that idea, Capcom, and make that your own thing? I don't know. I think they'll be fine with their fans. will be like, sweet, we wanted it anyway because we're using it right now. It's cool. Um, so, we get excited for that. If that's something that becomes a thing I can really fuck around with, maybe we'll see a review, maybe not. I don't what we'll fucking know. And, uh, sorry, I can't get the, the Mega Man Legacy Collection 2, which means that 7, 8, 9, and 10 are sort of off the table. Maybe I can get 7 somehow. 8 and or 9 and 10, or, I don't think I can, maybe, I don't know if there's a way to at this point, but 8, it definitely seems like I can't get 8 with, with the systems I have currently, so just so you guys know, that's an extra thing, and that's the bonus you get for sticking around, and and I'm out, I'm, out. I'm all out of E-Tank, so I, if, I, if, I'm, if I get close to dying now, chances are good that next hit kills me. Video games. Ugh. This is why this isn't intended for children. It's that's why I'm crazy right now. It's, it's not me. It's the E tank. Blame Capcom. They told me to do it. Um, um. Okay, really gonna go kick Doctor Wiley's ass now. Mega Man.